My name is not Five Weenies. I am Shoto from UA, and I want to be a hero. My father, Endeavor, is currently the number one hero, but to be frank, I've always hated him and want to forge my own path in the world what of What is this? A character introduction phase? Come on! Seen, so I felt so like... So boring. Shoto, fail! Sorry. Shoto Todoroki is a type O blood type. Endeavor is an AB. Shoto's not Endeavor's kid! Oh, let it go. I'm Shoto Todoroki, and even though I look like a burnt chicken nugget, I still love my mom. So can you tell me the rest of your plan now? Is that Aizawa's scarf you're making? It is. If you feel lonely, I could be lonely with you. Tell me, baby, why do you seem so blue? I brought clean clothes and something to keep you warm. Thanks. It's supposed to get kind of chilly next week. That sounds nice. <laughs> I like the cold. The heat's never been our thing, huh? I'm glad to see you're looking healthy. Ever since he started college, we stopped seeing him as much. I'm pretty sure he's got a new girl there. Oh, come on, sis. That's not fair. I call you guys. Anyway, you look great too, Mom. I'm happy to see a smile on your face. Any special reason? <laughs> well, Shoto has been sending me letters. He said the extra training for the provisional license is tough, but he's working hard to catch up to his friends. Wow. Didn't know he wrote you so much. Between living at the dorms and his training, he hasn't been able to pop by nearly as much. Hey, don't you think it's time they let you get a phone? It'd be easier than writing. You're right. I'll see what the doctors say. Can I see the letters? Sure. Just don't tell Shoto. Bye. Hmm? Did you see? He's officially number one now. Not Natsu! The world doesn't know what he did to you or to us. How terribly he treated his family. It's not like he ever mentions us or anything. Come on, why would you even bring him up? It's fine for you, me. I barely remember him being around. He's basically like a stranger to me, so I don't care what happens to him. Still, I can't stand that he pretends he never did anything bad to you guys. Especially to you, Mom. It's been about ten years since he put you in here, and he hasn't had the decency to apologize. 
He wants to leave the past behind and forget about his family. I don't think that's true. Why do you always insist on protecting him, Mom? See those flowers? He knows they're my favorite. I only mentioned it once when we just when we just met. Wait, Dad's been here? Many times, apparently. Of course, I haven't seen him. I'm still afraid, and the doctors don't think it's a wise idea. I have no idea what he's feeling or how his mind works, nor the external pressures that must be on him. But see, he is thinking about us. He's definitely trying to face his past and his family in his own way. stupid a damage you can never undo kind of stupid and open all the cages in the zoo kind of stupid truly you didn't think this through kind of stupid let's review you took a rumor look at my son pride is not the word i'm looking for there is so much more inside me now i told you this was only gonna hurt if I want to, that the fire's gonna burn Would you walk in, would you let me do it first? Do it up in the day you love me Hello, stand up! If you get hurt that easily, day. you can forget about beating All Might Or even a small-time villain Please, stop pushing him! He's only five years old! This is a place where I am Poor little Shoto Todoroki Stand up. If you get hurt that easily, you can forget about beating All Might, or even a small-time villain. Please stop pushing him. He's only five years old. You can take it. Get out of my way. I can't take it anymore. Every day, the children seem more like him. And Shoto, that child's left side sometimes looks unbearable to me. All I can see is his father. I can't raise him anymore. I want to run away from this life. Now stand up. If you get hurt that easily, you can forget about beating All Might, or even a small-time villain. Please stop pushing him. He's only five years old. You can take it. Get out of my way. 
I can't take it anymore. Every day, the children seem more like him. And Shoto, that child's left side sometimes looks unbearable to me. All I can see is his father. I can't raise him anymore. I want to run away from this life. She said, boy, you gotta tell me what they did to you. I said, you don't wanna know the things I had to do. She said, son, you gotta tell me why you're black and blue. I said, I didn't want trouble. I'm the boy in the bubble. But then she... Say something, I'm giving up on you. you're doing with your little friends but when you're living in my house we have rules here sorry mom i'm not really fluent in <laughs> My question is, do you, do you think it's too late for me? What? Am, am I just doomed to be the person that I am? It's, it's not too late for me. Bojack, I I, I... I need you to tell me that I'm a good person. I know that I can be selfish and narcissistic and... If my dolly is cold, can I put her in the toaster oven? No, honey, that would be a mistake. Mommy? What? I made a mistake. I become so numb, I can't feel you. I'm so tired, so much more away And hear that breaking sound Hopes and dreams are shattering apart And crashing to the ground I want to see you smile Know that means I'll have to leave Lately I've been, I've been thinking Clothes and something to keep you warm Thanks It's supposed to get kind of chilly next week That sounds nice <laughs> I like the cold the heat's never been our thing, huh? I'm glad to see you're looking healthy. Ever since he started college, we stopped seeing him as much. I'm pretty sure he's got a new girl there. Oh, come on, sis. That's not fair. I call you guys. Anyway, you look great too, Mom. I'm happy to see a smile on your face. Any special reason? <laughs> well, Shoto has been sending me letters. He said the extra training for the provisional license is tough, but he's working hard to catch up to his friends. Wow. Didn't know he wrote you so much. By the way, hmm? do you see? He's officially number one now. Not Natsu! The world doesn't know what he did to you or to us. How terribly he treated his family. It's not like he ever mentions us or anything. Come on, why would you even bring him up? It's fine for you, me. I barely remember him being around. He's basically like a stranger to me, so I don't care what happens to him. Why do you always insist on protecting him, Mom? See those flowers? He knows they're my favorite. I only mentioned it once when we just met. Wait, Dad's been here? Many times, apparently. 
Of course, I haven't seen him. I'm still afraid, and the doctors don't think it's a wise idea. I have no idea what he's feeling or how his mind works, nor the external pressures that must be on him. But see, he is thinking about us. He's definitely trying to face his past and his family in his own way.